Here's our bucket paper. Number one, which is less than 40? Circle which one is less than 40. Number two, patterns. 24, 26, 30, 32, 34. Now these are not counting by ones, they're counting by two. So you're gonna have to find which number is missing. Number three, we're adding those numbers together and subtracting those numbers. If this is hard for you, you can take another piece of paper or a whiteboard and you can stack them on top of each other. So put 71 on top and then put 14 underneath and then add up and down. You can do the same thing for subtracting too. Number four, circle 14. Number five, we have our fact families, give me an addition sentence and then answer and give me a subtraction sentence. Then let's do our basic addition facts over here. All right, number six. How many more cookies does Jill have than Pete? Ooh, how many more? That means subtracting. Here's Jill with her cookies. Here's Pete with his cookies. I need to subtract to see how many more Jill has. Number seven, let's take a look at that. All right, I know that's a coin. This is a, what is the name of that coin though? Penny, nickel, dime, or quarter. It is worth how many cents? Write that down. Number eight, there are how many carrots? How much all together? Write that there. How many tens are in that number? And how many ones are in that number? And then write your value of your tens, your value of your ones, and what does that equal? Number nine, show the same time on the other clock. Now let's look here. Look at my hour hand. Look at what room that's in. And then look at my minute hand. Remember, I count by fives around the clock. Fives, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, zero. Now you have to see where you stop. Where is that hand pointing? Then you need to write the time over here. The hour comes here, and then the minutes go after the colon. And number 10, circle all of the triangles. 